so. All right. Yeah, uh-huh. let's get into that now. What's going on? What did he do now? He's got fam? a new special on Netflix um, called Sticks and Stones. And he's basically, he's pressing a lot of buttons in it. He's trying to piss off a lot of people. He pressed every button. He's pissed off a lot of people in it. Like he was getting a lot of backlash over like Twitter and whatnot. But I think within this sketch, he's basically making a point that there's a lot of things in this PC world that obviously we can't talk about in it. And he's just mm-hmm. making jokes out of literally everything, whether it be the LGBT community, um, you know, gender, um, male, female, like equality and stuff like that. All sorts of stuff in it. He's but, a comedian. Well, yeah, this, that's, this is it. All right, this, this is, is it. it. Why are you taking him serious? Boom. <laughs> Good question. Man's got to <laughs> stop this here though. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's episode one. We're going to get episode two now. <laughs> now we're going to get into it now. Now yeah, we're going to get into it. I want to... And directed at the same time. <laughs> yeah, I like it. It's all mad, isn't it? Like, man, trying to... You get what I'm saying? That, that could be the ending so they couldn't get into it. But, but you know what it is? Enough. This ties very good into the PC world and why I feel like now we can break this cycle of this PC world. Is that is that mad? Because when I'm looking at it, yeah, everything he's saying, they actually can't cancel him. You actually cannot cancel. Well, you know, truths, there's truths. Number one, he's been consistent like there's that. From the he's beginning. been consistent like that from the beginning. Yeah. He has not changed. Number three, <laughs> because he doesn't give a fuck, you can't cancel him. Mm. That's one of the biggest things. If you actually don't care what no one says and say what you actually say, what? How can how can anyone cancel you? Because technically. You can't actually get arrested for saying what you how you feel. It's only a bunch of people on Twitter and Instagram yeah. saying, "Oh my yeah. God, he said this." Yeah. Rare, rare, rare. Police don't come to your yard and be like, "You're arrested." Most you do that. is just lose certain deals. Yeah, yeah you lose most, certain as, deals. As you said, he's a comedian. Yeah, and man. At the same time, you can't cancel someone who you clicked to watch their show. Exactly. That makes no sense to me. If they're cancelled, don't watch it. Exactly. If you hear something you don't like, just turn it off. Don't watch it. Exactly. But and they probably sat through the whole thing. But you would have to because it was so good. <laughs> Bro, was it then, good, yeah? yeah it bro, was, bro I'm watching it again before I was leaving my way. I wanted to watch it yeah. before I come, but when I get home, I'm watching it again, fam. I might watch that every day this week, fam. Like, oh, it's okay. Go on, it's very it nice. Nah, yeah. he, he goes in and he hits at a lot of people. He, bro, you see what the bit I liked? I, I liked where he said about um, where he couldn't say the word um, faggot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah. way he tied that in, I said, right, like, I was dying on the sofa for time because he's like, the woman, whoever the woman who's working for whatever said, oh, you can't. Like, they have these controls in it on the, yeah. the on Netflix or whatever, these on these channels, like HBO or whatever. So they give you guidelines of what you can say and what you can't say. And, blah, blah, blah. and then if you say something, then you get sent to these people and they write to you and they do all of this, whatever. You watch it anyway. Boom. So he's saying that this woman's called him in, he's gone there and said, oh, yeah, everything's fine with that episode that you've done, but you said the word faggot. Man, what, what's that? But you said the word faggot, yeah? So he's like, okay, like, yeah, um, you can't really say that. He's like, yeah, but I, I say the word like nigger. He's like, yeah, but like Dave, there's only one thing about it though. Like, you're, you're not a faggot. He said he's you're like, not gay. Yeah, he said, yeah, he said you're not yeah. gay. Yeah, you're not gay, sorry. He said, uh, you're not gay. Oh, yeah, you put yourself in And then he said, oh, he, he said, oh, no. oh, I'm not a nigger either. <laughs> Done a dance. Done. Done your dance, fam. What can you say back to that? Nothing really because well, well, yeah, okay. I'm gone. Have a good ne- my next show next week, same time. Ed, cool, boom, safe. No chat. I can't lie, there was a couple of things he said on there that I thought was a bit mad though. No, nah, there was a couple of things. The Michael Jackson <laughs> yeah, thing the was Michael mad. Jackson reference was a bit crazy. Well, did he, still. Oh, that was wild. He did, is it, oh. <laughs> he's a comedian. I feel like the LBG. No, nah, no, nah, but even this one was. No, nah, it, it was, was a bit too. Nuts. It, was, it was too. It was too much of a. Fam, man, I've been rinsing Michael Jackson from. No, early. no you no, don't know what he, he said, had, fam. Right, cool, I don't know what he's. Bro, there's been. Um, <laughs> Basically, you were saying. What yeah, about? Um, no, because you're gonna. Uh, you know what Rome's gonna do? He's gonna chat shit now, and then he's gonna watch it later and be like. He's gonna come in the group. Williams? Oh, is that <laughs> what he said? What about Cat Williams? No. That, yeah, Michael. <laughs> Jackson's just on the tree, just picking the little boys like flout. Like, that, that's <laughs> mad, fam. No, 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 but Dave Chappelle's one might be worse. He said if he was to pick one. I uh, know, yeah, forget <laughs> Dave. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> no, because you know what it was? You know what it is? Right? You know what it is? He, made a, he was trying to make a point saying, oh, that kid is almost like the cool kid in school because uh, at least he can go to school and say, on my weekend, yeah. I got my dicks up by Michael Jackson, innit? I don't think you know, he got to the crowd, he was saying, oh, half you lot in the crowd here have probably been molested before, but it weren't no Michael Jackson. So trying to make a point because it's Michael Jackson, uh, you should even feel somewhat privileged. Well, and then <laughs> I was like, "No, nah, this guy's moving oh, nuts." On. And then he was like, "Oh, if he was to pick one, he would pick um, Richie Rich, you know, the you, no, Macaulay Culkin, whatever his yeah. name is, that you." 
the home because he's brother. a richie home alone he said well, i'm gonna pick one i'll just pick a one a rich one that's got money <laughs> Now nah, he went deep. He went deep. He went deep. He went deep. You gotta watch it tonight. Um, but he's, he, he's a that, comedian. The LBGT um, reference that he done mm. was very good, though. Mm. I liked the, how he done that. Like how he referenced all of that. That was sick. Um, no nah, man, the comedy that was, was a very it, that was original comedy content yeah, for yeah, man yeah. fam. Mm. Yeah. Original what, back what, to roots. What I liked is that he was just showing how there's discrepancies, you know, in terms of our thinking. And if you put it in another context, it just it doesn't fit. And I think a good example when he was talking about, um, I think it was the opioid epidemic in America. Or something oh, like yeah, that, yeah, yeah. When, um, was it black Americans were suffering from drugs or whatnot? And mm. then they were saying, yeah, it's a war on drugs, blah, blah, blah. But then the, when the, when white, the man, white people yeah. are going through their drug problem, it's more of... Um, they need help. They need help. Yeah, and they whatnot. Like, so they're looking at it from two different perspectives for the exact the exact same symptoms, basically. Mm, mm, it was a bit mm, mad. Like, and that's, so that's real shit. Mm. They, but when it comes to black people, we're, we're, it's a crime for us. Yeah. <laughs> When it comes to white people, oh, they need help. What did you think about what you were talking about in regards to um, women obviously having a choice to have abortions or whatnot, but at the same time, because a man don't have that choice, really and truly, he doesn't, he believes man shouldn't have that choice, but they have the choice to actually have nothing to do with the baby. Do you know what? That he was, that was... It was good, but... Great. So he, he's basically trying that. to say that man not having a choice to abandon a baby and have nothing to do with it is the equal choice a woman has to abort a baby or keep it. Yeah. That's a fact because... Technically, what, he what he's saying is, if you bust inside a gal, basically, once you bust inside the girl, you actually have no power of what happens. Whether she keeps it or aborts it, that's on her decision. Yeah. But if she has that baby, now it's your decision whether you want to stay or go. Because if you didn't originally want that baby, you know, technically you have to stay. Yeah. I think that was good. I've never seen it from that perspective before. But do you agree with it? Do you agree with his perspective? <laughs> What if I didn't want it and then you turn around and had it? So he's basically saying, nah, yeah, if you, if, yeah, I don't if, agree. if she goes, if she turns around and has it and uh. you don't want it, do you see that as a, a and as an equivalent to a woman having a choice to keep her and abort a baby? Like you have an option to abandon it without no repercussion. So you don't have to pay no t- um, child support or nothing. I feel like you shouldn't have to pay child support. That should be a choice. But you would have to be in a child's life though, I think. Mm. Well, I'll give you the child's life and shut out no money fam. No, but obviously you're gonna shell out money. I mean, just take That's, them, take, you know take the child. Yeah. But no, I'm not giving. Oh, don't her. pay money to her. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I get you. Because that CSA, comes like a tax. Yeah. Huh? That comes just like a tax. Yeah, it's really. a tax, fam. You, you uh, like? I think women that you know pursue child support in that in that regards, yeah, it would just ruin the relationship the father could potentially have with the child because he's always gonna think in the back of his mind, like, you know, it's just I don't know, it's just. <sighs> but I, know, I get it's, what you're it's saying. It's tricky from the start, when brother. You I've you been, me? I was in that situation, and it's just like, bro, I offered you this, <laughs> you went here, mm. got let, like, now you've you've actually fucked up the relationship and and the thinking of how I even think of you. Mm. Yeah, for yeah, real. yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't rate you now that you've done. Yeah. That. Do you get what I'm saying? How yeah. could I? How could I rate you? <laughs> this right? just remind me, actually. Funny enough, I was going home from work in it, and I met one of my bedrooms was ca- was having a little catch up, and the same things happened to him. Yeah. So obviously he's beat this thing or whatnot. And hasn't spoken to her in a while, whatever. Cool, he's obviously doing his own thing, whatever. Then he said, a letter's come through the post <laughs> saying that um, you have a, a child in it or whatnot. And this is when the child's like three years old at this time. Three? Three, bro. Now that's right. mad. That's exactly. So he's had to do a DNA test, everything. Child's his in it. Obviously, he's now got to start being in the child's life. But he's now paying child support as well. Child, um, child yeah, 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 as well. Yeah. He's got a relationship with his son or whatnot. But he was saying for like the next two, three years, he was just angry. Do you get know what I'm trying to say? Because it's like, obviously he's he's sorting out his life in adjustment to what he was aware of. He didn't know he had a, had a son or whatnot. Obviously now Charles calm. It's a massive life change. Laws of responsibility. Yeah. The money's obviously not gonna. It's not. It's not the same. It's not the no same. More, really. he, he needs that. He needs longer money in it, basically. But he was just angry for the simple fact that the girls just come out of nowhere, just come for peas and whatnot. And yeah, girl, the girls need to stop it's, doing it's that. It's mad because like, you're gonna look at the son and think, oh, like. This girl's just brought you on me here, like this. you don't even know the son yet. You don't, yeah, you, you haven't, you're not in love with the son yet, like that. You yeah, and it's and it's, and it's, it's, that it's, it's bad on the on the kids in that sense because the problems that you've got now mm. kind of re- is reflecting on the child. Mm. Like I don't think women should just be allowed to, like, say yeah. Like it, I get it, it takes two to tangle to have sex, so why does it not take two to actually make the decision on on what's happening with this baby? Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, I mean, I, I we should it. sit down and be like, yo, realistically, mm. 
Like why? I don't understand why women want to have babies for you, for a man them that's not even there anyway. That doesn't make sense. The to thing me. is, women uh, a lie. That don't make Say no sense to me. What's that? Why? Like, why women want to have children for a man yeah. that doesn't even want to be with them? You're right, but at the same time, they'll turn around and be like, "Oh yeah, I'm living with my mistake. I'm I'm dealing with it. Blah blah blah." But it's like now they're forcing another, the other person to also deal with a mistake because they're dealing with a mistake. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Yeah, but if this is my point though, if we had this conversation, then you wouldn't be feeling. Because she feels like it's a mistake because she hasn't got the father there no more. Mm. Like, we're not in a relationship, so we don't have a family unit. More time, they knew what the situation was as well, you know? This is my, po- I, this is my point. So they know <laughs> they what, the what the situation was. They know they're a beat, they're or they know they're link. And it, in their head... Oh, we thought it was something serious and tell ourselves, like, get out. In their head, it's like, knew. oh my... I'm, you know what matters, you know? Half the time, they knew. They knew what the situation was. Fam. Like, there are some situations where maybe a guy and girl was dating... Girl falls pregnant, obviously unplanned, and the guy freaks out and he's just not on it. He busses out. That's but different. There are a lot of situations where girl the girl love. knew she was just nothing but a chop, and that's it. And then she's trying to just. But you know what it is with girl, like yeah. That. Not even trap man, but <laughs> inconveniencing by like just imposing herself. I think man should be allowed ten reasons why a man shouldn't have the baby, and then if man could certify ten reasons, if you got certified ten reasons, then yeah, we you don't have it. We have an agreement. Wait, what? So if you're having a sit down, yeah, and you give your ten reasons why you can't have this baby, mm. she shouldn't be able to have it. Right, boom, you wanna, I, what's ten good valid reasons? Would you, let's do that I, right I, now. I can't be a I, ne- <laughs> <laughs> That's wild, bro. It is wild. Think but about it. Are you sure you wanna ask these questions? Because it just makes it look like you're thinking. Mm. No, but if you're Go in on. a situation, you two, cool. We're we're beating or whatever. Yeah. But we're beating and we're just a link. Mm. Now, nah, I understand it takes two to tango. Mm. A man should be using protection. Yes. Always wear protection. Course, but in the, in, strap the, up kids. in the heat of the moment, sometimes the kitchen's a bit too hot. You get yeah, me? So no, you have to open need, doors. You need self-control. Like, a like, lot of it. Yeah, please. but in the, you don't wear a jacket all through summer. You get what I'm saying? So. <laughs> <laughs> I lie. So boom, sometimes. sometimes well, you clothes, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, sometimes it's a bit hot though, isn't it? So you get me. But when carnival come round, you take your top off. Yeah, when carnival <laughs> come round, you take the top off. Like, you get me? It's only two days out of the year sometimes, you get me? And so that two days is when it all goes and tits up, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's a tits up, you know. So, but no, there, to be honest, there has to be a conversation. It has to be. There has to be. Like, you can't, women can't, shouldn't be just allowed to say, yo, boom, I'm having this baby. You have no say. Or just come to a man three years later. That is crazy. Same on the other side, like a man shouldn't just walk out on his child, innit? Mm. So this is why there has to be a conversation before that. And then they come, ah, oh, but I carried this child for nine months. Like, listen, man carried mine for 30 years. Allow me, innit? Mm. You get what I'm saying? What, you oh, think that, that you think the sperm ain't just, man gave it to you for the egg to grow it and bring it back to me. You get me? That's but wild, if I don't want, <laughs> if I didn't want that sperm to be brought back to me at this present moment in my life, oh my that God, is not fair. Guy. No, no, I changed my mind. <laughs> if, <laughs> if if man's going bareback freely, yeah, fam, you, you have to hold to it, hold your responsibility. Yeah, you have to hold the responsibility. But if I go in there with a the condom and it busts, yeah, then yeah, I have all rights to tell you not to have that because I wasn't trying to have that. That's why I wore the condom. But what if you what, if you don't wear a condom, are you, were you trying to have a you? Or you just well, the, to... the, the potentials was there in it, fam. Mm. And and no contraception, no contraception. So wait, you're telling, telling me you didn't know it, bust, and then you're you continuing. Mean? Certain times you don't know, fam. Yeah, man would know still. What if it bust? Yeah, bro. Yeah. Man man no, not all the time. Some some boom boom's dead. <laughs> <laughs> but it's true though. <laughs> Yeah, for real. Some the real, the real, de- yeah. the real wet ones will let you know. All right, you will be like, bro, this is. Yeah, the dry ones will let you know, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the wet ones, you don't know if a guy wet in there, you get and, and it's, it's still warm. Like, it's warm but you fam. might know because you be like, bro, this feels sick. a bit warmer than normal, you know. <laughs> but you know what? It feels good. But you want, and then, and then you go, oh my. <laughs> <laughs> but when it's dry. You know straight away, like, no, I'm too much friction. What's going yeah, on? You pull out. Like, it was, yeah, oh. like, what's going on? Then you run away, like, with the thing, like, oh, my, this is dead. It's dry anyway. <laughs> yeah, fam, it's all, it's all wild, It's fam. mad still. It's mad. But that's a, that's a it's, mad topic. You know, it's you know, a mad topic. Um, I feel like we need females in yeah, there. Facts. Too. Yeah, facts. We do. We're gonna, right, we've got a few females coming. Yeah, 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 just to talk, talk on that one there. In a few weeks anyway. Like, we've got a few female guests, hopefully. I don't, I don't, like, with them topics kind of like there, yeah, 
I, I, I'm a bit reluctant to talk about it without females because I don't want to come yeah. across ignorant, innit? I can obviously give no, my perspective. No, but but females, get, get involved. New females yeah. on the YouTube sure. comment under the under the video or um on the Twitter and that hashtag us and let us know what you think. Get involved in the combo. Yeah, I agree with sports. Is conversations needed. You can't just conversation is very just, important because mm. well, a lot of these things are happening without conversation. Yeah, and yeah. then a lot of these things is why people have resentment against each other, fam. But if you have a conversation and then. Like, cool, all right, we've had, I know we had sex. And I know we done it there, right? Do you really want the baby? Quite if I, like, I can't, like, I don't want to give away my conversation. But I'll give it like a, 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 a hypothetical conversation that I had. So it, it kind of went like. Does that make sense? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, go on. Of course. Go. So hypothetically, this is, this is how the conversation could have went or would have went. Yeah. We're not, like, listen, there's no point in us having this baby because I don't want to be with you, innit? We're not going to be together. <laughs> and you're not going to have a family unit like your mum and dad, your grandparents, your sister and that. Like everybody all over there, they're all married and they're all looking. You get what? They, mm. they have a, f- a f- you're not going to have that. Mm. Why? No, you don't want to be with a girl. The girl I told her to be. Yeah, like, hypothetically, I told her that I didn't want to be with her and this is not what your setup's going to be. So if you have this baby, I didn't directly say not have the baby. I said, if you have the baby, then I, you, I'm just going to be a weekend dad, innit? Basically. And you're not going to have the family unit that the rest of your family actually have. You're going to be, you're going to break that cycle of being a single parent. Huh? That's yeah, mad. So why are you going bareback then? They're both responsible for that, really. Because really and fam. truly, if a man's not, got, if a guy's not strapped, she can still say no, you know? But I was in a dark place Obviously, at that time, fam. Mm. It was a low point in my life, fam. And she mm. was there to be, uh, you get what I'm saying? It's Comfort and, and look, you get, I was very vulnerable, fam. Bringing my food. I couldn't afford food. Well, you took off the condom, you just cried. To, 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 <laughs> you, I didn't even take it off her and put one on. You said uh, <laughs> <laughs> you, you just looked at the packet like. I don't think that was packet there. Miss, man. I don't think that was even there. I don't know if it was in the wallet. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, dumb, bro. <laughs> To be honest, I even wore the condom of my life. <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong with you, man, bro? This guy's an idiot. Looks this funny, you know. No, no, but no. So yeah, it was a, it was a real. I had that conversation, but mm. obviously she wanted to keep. So it was cool, like whatever. But at the same time, my situation was different because it wasn't just me involved. Mm. You get what I'm saying? But I'm not gonna be up the whole like, allow her now, innit? Like I've, I think I've rinsed her enough over the years. She used to give my stress, fam, but she's cool now, we're cool. Everything's kosher. Get my you and I can get my you. You know that. So mm. we're good. No beef. For now. For now. For now. But I keep it like that because I don't I don't even chat to her. There's no there can't be no conversation between us. So that's why there's no beef. Yeah, for real. Because if, if if I feel like there's any kind of beef coming to man, then I, I that's it, conversation done. I don't even reply. <laughs> I don't reply, fam. Well, you yeah, get in touch, man. So you get me. Get in touch and let us know how, how you feel. Proper. But imagine they get sticky now and they try to use the you against you. you yeah, I don't rate it. that, you know. Yeah. Not wait, in the slightest. What? I don't rate it. Well, well, I don't rate that. Fam. But it's a possibility. You can't it see your you. It's stupid. I don't know. All of this because women actually want you. Yeah. More time, even something like you, a woman that you, doesn't want you, you know, the hypo- will let you see a you, you know, you know the hypothetical yeah. situation you come up with. Yeah, there's situations where, like, after that, they'll be like, Oh, he will change when once the child comes. All right, they think that's gonna happen. That's in the hypothetical and then as well. He hits them. That man told you that <laughs> you're not getting this, this family this is, foundation. Fam, you was this is the, bro, <laughs> that, that was in the hypothetical as well. And this is the situation where I didn't understand. Sometimes you tell gal exactly what it is. Mm. And in their so head, you do that enough though, bro. I swear there was a. T- a I told a, it um, all um, the time. Every one, time we was in bed, we were just a link. Like, like, like <laughs> from the jump, like. Yeah, what I'm saying, For I'm just on this front. Don't ever think about Rome's. Is man, is man really putting that out there? Rome's. No, some man are. Some, yeah, Rome, some man, bro. some man are. I, bro, I put it out there, bro. Bro, yeah, even right. one time she was right. in my yard. I went in the shower. My phone's there, open, they weren't closed, because obviously my single, I'm just doing my thing. Open, she went in the phone, she saw I was going on another link. She's like, oh, so she's sitting on my bed like, so you're going on another link? Yeah. What, are you going to be here when I'm back, or are you going, I don't know, like, yeah, let me know. <laughs> yeah, I went, fam. And when I come back, she's still there. All right, cool. Man's an honest you, you know? Yeah, you have to be honest, fam. But if they don't take the honesty, what can man do, fam? Mm. 
Yeah, that's not my fault. You took you misread. I don't know. I don't know how you can. I can give you a book, and the words are in the book, and then you decide to read another book, fam, or put another another page of another book in that book. I'm like that. When and then when I'm going through, I'm like, right, this page wasn't in this. This ain't part of this book. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? <laughs> no, that's this real. You get that's what I'm saying? Still, this that's real. You know what I told you? I told mm-hmm. you directly. This here. Yeah. Boom. I told you in the contents index throughout yeah, the whole book. Yeah, but it had ten chapters, not yeah. eleven. <laughs> <laughs> Like, bro, it's all mad. Yeah, fam, it's all mad. But yeah, <laughs> man, I don't know. But yeah, let us know, man. Let us know how you feel on that situation and what women are do. Or even send in a dilemma and we'll cover something. You get some me? backlash with this. But you yeah. know what? We have to that, get backlash. You said something that reminded me of that um, tweet that went out. That girl, she said, I've learned that men are very easy to understand. They will dead ass tell you everything in the most simplest ways. It's women who twist words into something they want to hear. Trying to figure shit out when he already told you. Who's, I, who's saw, I that? saw. I saw that. I saw that. I don't know. Just some random person. Cloud, 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 cloud. Viral. And bear girls in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> bear girls in the comments were like, "Oh, you're too loud. You're too loud." Yeah, because they know it's but true. But they know it's, it's true. Because gal actually do. I feel Mama's like simple. I feel like gal do listen to man, but they don't want to. No. They don't want to allow us to have our. We, they don't want uh, whatever we're thinking. They don't want uh, that to manifest. Mm. Whatever they need to manifest. What is it's that silly word they keep asking from? Why? <laughs> Why has a long tail? It allow it, like do you know yeah. what I mean. Z, Z, <laughs> done. Full stop, yeah. Da. I don't the know. Random, actually simple, fam. We're simple. Is. This is how it is. This that's, is how I want see, it to be. All that wanting to ma- wanting to uh, manifest and whatnot. That's when they start using that law of attraction at the wrong time, bro. They're trying to tell them if they if they say it, if they say this is what's gonna happen. It's gonna happen for the minute, but in reality, it don't work I feel out. Like <laughs> the man need to be careful with their words, though, fam. Yeah, yeah, they take certain words serious. It's true, because there man, are they guys d- out here selling dreams too. See, yeah, man, yeah, don't oh, yeah, ever yeah, get it twisted. I've been guilty of that in the yeah, past. Yeah, 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 100%. Like, no, I'm not going to act like man don't sell dreams sometimes. You have to. What? As a youth, what? Dream? You say what you sell dreams? Bro, man used to. What? What? There's discount with my team. <laughs> You Big get man. discount with my man, 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 yo, dreams, you dreams, know, fam. <laughs> they should hire man in the store, cause the way I'm selling dreams, fam. The beds will be flying out of there, cause. <laughs> Are you mad? A man said discount. Beds will be dreams. flying, you Trust know. Me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, vicious. No, the cycle is vicious, though, fam. But girls do the same thing. You know what? Oh, there was something. Oh, you know what? Yeah. I wanted to get onto the girls about. All right, I'm going back to carnival quickly. Sorry, Ross. <laughs> going back to carnival. Just one quick topic that I don't like cool I understand that girls go out and they're half naked and we was talking about girls being half naked and I understand that there is man them that do pinch bums I've seen girls that's complaining oh this guy touched this and he done that and you know what yeah it, it's wrong you know man them shouldn't be going around yeah, touching pom pom touching bums and touching breasts do and rare, rare rare but what I'm going to say it might cause a little controversy be careful number one don't go to carnival because that is kind of a thing that is expected in carnival. No, that's ignorant to say. No, 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 no. So, no let me finish. Let me let me finish. Go on, go on, land. Yeah, let me land. land. It's, it's land. kind of expected. It's always been a thing. Mm. And number two, it's not just man them doing it. Because there was bare girls. Oh. Yeah, girls do it. And man come dressed. I hate we're clothed. And clothed. <laughs> I hate clothed when girls and go and on the it. timeline, chat shit when there was about hundred girls going out doing the same raw. You know how much girl was touching man's bum? No, Look at that girl that ran up to you, grabbed your things and ran off. That, that happens to me in rape. Fam. That was rape. It's rape. Fam. That's rape. It yeah, is. And when girl do it, it girl is. do it, it way worse than man them fam. <laughs> Bro, I've been in, I've been in raves here yeah, and they've come walk past me and grab my crotch and then walk off. And, and I'm, I'm like, not, listen, I am not. And you don't know how to react because the first time it happened to me, it's like, if I get annoyed because I'm thinking this is assault and I'm getting annoyed because I know she's going like, to like, it to her <laughs> and I'm gay. Yeah. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Yeah. But, now she's going to think I like it because I ain't said nothing. And it's giving her the confidence to carry on talking Cut, to me. Right, Stay oh. away from me. <laughs> Fam. Now, I'm not saying it's right, but let's not just act like it's man them. Mm. I don't like that. I don't like when it's girls both, go on the timeline man. and just act like it's just man. It's oh, man both. are hungry. Man do this. Uh, you need to see what some of these girls are out here They're doing. doing. No, it's mo- ridiculous. I, I felt away still. Mm. Yeah, you was, you was like... I was rattled, fam. Yeah, he was rattled. <laughs> like, obviously, I was like, rah. But it was like, it was, you know, it was the whole action. It was it the was grab more, and the run off. It's more yeah. that she ran off. You was vexed that she ran off. I don't, this guy. Yeah, which, you was you nice. that she ran off, fam. Which is nice. I don't, I don't think she's like <laughs> It's always the dead ones that are brave, bro. The dead ones are nothing to lose, you know? you know. They got nothing to lose because they had the no anyway. So it's like, if you say no, <laughs> <laughs> it's, they're going to be in the same position. But that guy didn't need to run off, though. She grabbed his ear and ran. Ran, fam. I was like, take run. it with her. Yeah, she. <laughs> <laughs> that was ridiculous, fam. 
<laughs> no, that was ridiculous still. She kicked out still. And then one next girl gone behind me and she's grabbed my bum. But I've turned, I've looked. <sighs> she's dead. No, some girls I don't do... want to say that she was dead because if she listens to this podcast, no, she might know she, man. No, no, if she's dead, she's dead. But there are right, some girls, dead. they do force the situation she though, man. Some see, I, I, I turned around, I tried to miss that. I was hoping it wasn't her. So I see it was someone else. But I think it was her because the way she was looking like, I just turned back around. Funny enough, in Carnival now, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's actually quite funny. It wasn't this year, a couple of years back still. But um, I had a girl come up to me. I was like, oh, yeah, my friend likes you, innit? So I must have been like, so why are you coming to tell me? Why yeah, can't I your never friend, understood that. Why can't your friend come tell me, innit? Tell your friend to come chat to me. I'm still walking, innit? And then maybe like five minutes later, I feel like I tap. And the girl turns. I turn around. I see the girl. She's like, oh, yeah, um, my friend said that you said I should come over to you. And I was, I was like... No, nah, I never actually said that, but um, I think my bedroom wants to talk to you, innit? Because I looked at the girl, she, she was, was finished, bro. <laughs> I would have told her, cool, I would have said, I'm like, it was my bedroom still, and he was he was still right next to me. He didn't know what to say because he didn't know I was going to swerve like that. I would have said, yo, call your friend back. Which one? <laughs> that friend, call her back. <laughs> Stand back over there quick. I just took the bedroom. No, but you know what it was, though? I was. I was like, I felt under duress because it's like, she was right there in front of me. I said under duress. <laughs> <laughs> I had to react quick in it. So I just literally threw my, my bedroom under the bus, bro. No, you're like, deep. yeah, he yeah, called nah. you still. Well, the was on you, you know. <laughs> nah, yeah, that's the worst. That's all I just want to touch on. I forget man them always getting in trouble for it because girls do it. So if we're going to be equal here, fuck that. Fam. Can't be equal in everything, but there's some things where you can be and they just choose not to be. Yeah, exactly. They cherry pick a that, lot. Bam. They're, they're ruthless. Anyway, Arsenal draw 2 2, so we didn't get banned. Just throw that out there quickly. That's crazy. Hmm. Another mad thing that. Bro, there's been a lot of mad things that's happened this week, you Go know. On. Obviously, Shout out missed. Missed got shot in the week, innit? Oh, my days. Oh, well, oh yeah, in Portugal, innit? about that one. Yeah, man. Uh, shout out missed that he's, he's all right. He's all right. He's yeah, back. yeah, man. Love that, man. You get me? Don't want to see nothing happen. Man, them trying to rob man them for the jewels and that. Like, it's just silly, fam. Like, man, them can't even live. But do you feel like, do you feel like what's happening to UK artists, or what used to happen to American artists, is happening to UK artists now when we're traveling? Do you know what I think it is. Like I think with that situation again, I'm just speculating here in it. But obviously he he's, he wears his jewelry, you know he's got every right to um, wear it. He's bought, he's earned it, cool. But it's like in certain countries, I don't know about Portugal, but in certain countries there may be parts there that they're, they're like poor parts in it. Mm. So. When poor people are seeing a man come with money or yeah, they, they get a drop on someone, they're thinking there's an opportunity to mm. pick yeah, up a thing and then it, you know what? make a quick change of yeah. shot in it. So it was, they were just trying to be opportunists, maybe. Yeah, yeah. I, no, I feel like that's, you're right. I feel like we shouldn't be naive to that because it's the same. When you know someone's coming over to the UK, mm. man are on them. Like, what? He's where? All right, boom, man, get the phone. Don't think it ain't the like, same for the foreigners. You can't, like, go, yo. you can't go certain countries like that unless you're certy there. Yeah. Like, you couldn't go Ghana, Nigeria, jeweled up like that. Never. You get robbed at the airport. Do you get me? Yeah, could go to Brazil they like that. You. What, Brazil? Oh, safe. That's what I said, oh, safe. safe. So they'll kidnap you at the yeah, airport. Them safe, countries like. kidnap you at the airport, They'll, they'll take your whole, well, they your whole being. They don't, they, they, no, they, they move smarter in them countries. They don't um, catch you at the airport. They, they catch you at the airport, but they follow you. And they go right they back yeah, to it. And they'll be like, okay, so that's where he stayed. So the little kid with a bike, fam. Yeah, 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 yeah. That happens. Yeah. So the mind man will just follow you all the way back. Okay, yeah. you stay in here. Boom, go. Okay. That's what they've the probably man, done when, yeah. when obviously, Snap. He's, he's going to have fans in Portugal and all over the world. Yeah. So they're going to be like, raw, yo, my man's coming over, you know. Oh, he's staying here. And then you're, when you're snapping, obviously you're snapping. It's, this is a new territory to you. So you yeah. might not know it, but they might see the snap and be like, raw, he's right yeah. there in that you know location. It, is, it might be known to them as well, because if I remember correctly, I do remember reading where he stayed was a place that was popular to, I think, a few footballers mm. that have gone out there and they stayed there as well. So if they're familiar with these footballers who stay there and these footballers are global, I think it was like Chelsea players or something like that. Mm. If a man is staying there and he's not a footballer, he must still have money for he can afford to stay yeah, there. So they yeah. must know yeah, like, this guy's okay. got something. Even if they, if they, but it's the whole yeah. getting shot thing that surprised yeah, that's mad. Me. Yeah, like, man. Like, if I heard robbed, I'd be like, ah, you've gone to another They might have not even really. intended to shoot him though. They might have just intended to just hold him up at gunpoint and they could have got techie. I don't know what the situation yeah, is. Yeah, true. Yeah. Or they could have, because where it looked like he got shot, they were just like, bow. Yeah. <laughs> Give me a stuff. Or maybe there could have been a tussle trying to hold a gun down and have just pulled it off. You don't know, innit? Get his stuff. I don't know. It looked like he had his jewels still. It looked know. like he had the big chain, the sick main chain. I don't know. I was like, that's what the it's report said. Though. I can't go off what the report say. Mm. He had his mm. jaws on. He looked, he just looked like he had his leg and he come back in it. So he had his passport. Yeah. They said they took his passport and his jaws, fam. Maybe they just run up in the hotel and shot him and then the rest of the man and beat him up. 
I mean, you can still get like emergency passport stuff to travel if you want it? it. Yeah, but you have to pay a little buck for that. Mm, he's got that, man. Yeah, he's got that, man. <laughs> yeah, I mean, quickly go to the embassy quickly and I just give my passport, fam. But um, I don't know. That's that's well, a couple of things has dropped as well. Kano's. Are you listen to Kano's? Yeah, yeah, someone told me that is a big boy. I think it's cold. I listened to the first couple still. couple of tracks. I listened to all of it. I think it's hard. Heady one's thing. Yeah, Heady yeah. one's thing. It's cold as well. Cold. I've listened. It's to a bit that. long though, but it is a bit it's, long. It's good. But some of the tracks getting there to the end is good though. I it, think it, more the beginning. The is The beginning better. is sick. Yeah. It maybe goes a little in the middle, and then at the end well, comes like bangers. Though. Versatile, isn't it? He's, he's sure very he versatile. He can do certain things, isn't it? You know what I'm saying? He's very, 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 versatile. But what you're versatile. known for, mm. people just rather you do that, innit? The what, drill just thing. The drill there was a lot of music. You had Kano, Weston dropped a thing recently. Oh, yeah, Weston. Well. I, I listened to Weston. Yeah. Still. It's not bad as well. I listened to Weston. They dropped a thing. But yeah, good was, music coming yeah, out, man. Music. The work rate's crazy, fam. Mm. Yeah, Over here, yeah, fam. Boy, listen, I should be, so that means we should be looking out for more listening party episodes. But do you know what? Do you know why I think the work rate's so high right now, though? Because I feel like because there's so much availability in music, mm. they're aware that us music consumers, yeah, we get, we're spoiled already because we can just stream everything in it. We, we'll, the music will fall off the map very quickly. So to mm. to keep the money rolling in from whatever streams they're getting, they need to come up with some, some new content sooner rather than later. Mm. When you look at music from back in the day, some people could be making music of old music for time. Mm. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Because them days, you're actually having to buy CDs and, and whatnot. Now music's everywhere, it's available. Do you, Aye, get but what do you feel say? like we they, we could go back to that longevity thing? I feel like there's certain artists... I don't think like, so. I still feel like there's certain artists that do it, but do it by accident. Like yeah, yeah, Scraps yeah. is an example. He don't yeah. put out a lot of stuff all the time, but I could still go back to that the latest um, different cloth mm. and it still bangs just the same right now. Yeah, I, I, I agree Just as good. Still, yeah. There's but certain the, artists that the, can do the that. The thing is though, the thing is though, now the way, you know, the like this whole music infrastructure is set up here, it's it's too music is too easily available, isn't it? Mm. So it's just like, I'm not gonna lie to you, there are some albums or projects that are out there that I think are classics. I think they're solid and when it eventually comes on, I'm not skipping the track, but I don't go looking for them songs. More time when I'm in my car driving, it's more put it on random or I'm playing the most recent thing that I've recently downloaded because mm. it's fresh, it's brand new. Mm. Yeah, Do you get yeah, me? Yeah. I'm saying Kano's thing's hard now. I've been probably listening to that for the last three, four days now. Yeah. The moment something else comes, it's you're, gonna yeah, be that. You're jumping then on. I might occasionally go back to Kano's. Then I'm mixed with all the other things that I might yeah, occasionally yeah. go I, back I can't, to. I feel yeah. like it me? depends on how good it is, if I'm honest, because I know what you're saying. Like It does come in, mm. but then I find myself going back to, like Gets I will go back to. Like, I feel like that's an album that, is mad. And, it's and in the car. I was rating that album, you know, hard. I've probably gone back to it probably like twice. Is it? That's because so much music's come out. I'm not gonna lie, I, I go like back to it I've gone back to an album back to twice. It. I feel like it's a good album. Yeah, no, don't get me wrong. There's probably some albums out there that I still think are good, but I have it hasn't come to my mind to go back to them yet. And no. that's because I'm just so spoiled with maybe, the amount yeah, of music. Yeah, maybe I'm not as, as consumed. What I do, what I tend to find myself doing is like if I'm at home, I'll just put it on YouTube. So mm. I'll put on the music videos and I'll let it run through. Mm. Now I'll hear all the tunes there. If I'm in the car, I might play something proper. I'm going to play dance or I'm going to play an album. Like I listened back to Trillery's thing the other day. I just go through little stages of trying to go back and listen and taking in more of, of content. So mm. the Gets, I've, I go back to Gets regular. I've gone back to Trillery. I've gone back to Scraps. I've gone back to Scraps regular. I'm, mm. I normally go back to Scraps well, after the studio at night time. <laughs> go back home, you get? Yeah, bro. I'm, I'm, scraps is a regular thing in my car, you know. <laughs> I can't lie. I like Scraps. No, I, would, I listen to all my albums at home. Mm. Yeah. If I'm in the car or somewhere on the road, I just listen to certain tunes out of different albums. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But in terms of like listening to someone's project, I always do that at home. Mm. Like the mm. whole thing. I wouldn't listen to a whole album walking on the road and I'm like that. I just it depends. To tunes. I don't listen to music that much at home, to be honest. I only listen to music at home if I'm cooking. Mm. So it's mm. just something just playing in the background. Other than that, it's either when I'm commuting to work or in the gym. Or if I'm gonna drive somewhere, that's the only time I listen to music, really. So no, I just I try to listen to music all the time yeah. now. I try to cut. Oh, do you cut go TV. through like the albums though? So not in the gym. In the gym, a specific type of music yeah, that yeah, gets yeah, me pumped in it. Yeah, yeah. You get me. But if I'm commuting and I know because I've got a long commute in it, then I might listen to the whole album and listen to it all the way. Okay. Or um, if I'm on my other job where I'm doing the night shifts, then I might do that because I've got mm. time to kill in it. Do you get me? Yeah. If you're the night thing mm. and you can just chill, yeah, you can go through everything. Mm. Then you get me. But um, more time I spend watching, I spend that time watching Netflix, I can't even lie. I'm not going to lie, you know. I want to do that. What's that? I want to be at work or on my break or whatever, watching TV. I see mm. bare people do it, but I just don't know if I have enough battery life for but that I'm, life. <laughs> I'm set because 
where I am, I got iPad there, and there's a plug charger. I'm good. Oh yeah, so yeah. I'm just there all day. Nah, my battery don't last, fam. I can't. Yeah, I can't yeah, really I can't, do that. Yeah, can't do the that TV still, the thing. No, nah, <laughs> I don't do it on my phone. I've got an iPad in it. So oh, you got an iPad? Yeah, okay, I, I use that. The iPad so. um, battery is strong still. It's not even that. It's it's plugged into the charger anyway. Anyway, so, so you just leave it running. I'm just um, rinsing all my shows like that. So I don't even like plugging mm-hmm. things into chargers and using it, fam. Just in case it might blow up, fam. <laughs> do you use your phone while it's on charge? Nah, not really. I sometimes. I'm guilty of it sometimes. It Halfway depends. through the day, but I, I normally I charge. Still. I always <laughs> charge my phone and then it will go all the way dead and then I charge it. Yeah, I don't charge it overnight though. I charge it overnight. I do. No, because over time your battery will start to get weaker as well. Mm. Is it? Yeah, so I don't do that anymore. No, I do. I, I only do it because I don't stay up long through the night. So by the time I go to bed and, and think, I probably it probably just touched 100%. Yeah. But they think. say you're supposed to use your phone until it dies and yeah. then that's charge it. That's what I do. You know, when it's on like... 30 percent and then yeah. someone will be like yeah let me get a charger like you're yeah. not supposed no, to do things today, yeah mine i always i will so i charge mine through the night go to work and then where it will until it dies so that might it might die like one o'clock mm. two o'clock from but that's me going to work at five o'clock in the morning i'm all right i'm all right up until nine ten when everyone starts waking up and banging off man's line <laughs> then my battery starts moving militant from there because maybe before then i'm just on podcast or music or whatever do you know what i'm saying mm. and after that when everyone's awake yeah boy sometimes don't even last the, uh, just after my break i go back on the band and it's dead but um my phone lives on low battery mode i can't even lie is it yeah my man. phone lives on dead phone. Lives. <laughs> yeah and then i go home i charge it up again and then it'll, it'll rinse just before i go to bed mm. and then i charge it through the night so i'll probably charge my phone three times a day that's a lot, you know. But two times a day. That's a lot still. Well, like, you... I know I charge my first thing in the morning because I don't charge it open. As soon as I wake up, I plug it in and start getting ready. And I don't touch it until I'm ready to leave the yeah, house. Yeah, yeah. If, I t- if I keep touching it, I'm slowing it down from charging, innit? And obviously... But how long do you take to get ready, though, and, and leave? I'm not going to lie. I'm slow, bro. I ah, see. I'm slow. Come on, I give oh. myself... Scrub properly. Not like these people that don't scrub their legs. No, I scrub, man, scrub I properly, fam. Yeah, you don't no, scrub there's, their there's legs, some man. people out there that aren't scrubbing their legs and yeah, that. some men are not nah, bathing they're, they're not yeah, showering in the morning and I know yeah, some people are not showering in the morning because the smell that I'm smelling yeah, is not ridiculous. a normal smell like and you can't tell me uh, because late. I shower at night nah bro have <laughs> consideration yeah you can't have a have consideration for them people you're cute oh that with. just remind me from us oh one woman on the train fam Kissing up her man and what not what. But that shit pisses me off, you know. Mad be old fam. Swear it down. I'm like, what, you can't tell her, big man? <laughs> but you're just kissing <laughs> her up uh, like that. That's nah, mad. That he's he's crazy be old though. used to it because he's around her so much. What do you mean used to it? Nah, you can't get used to it. No, you can't used to them thing there. That's that. Man. Stink, innit? Like, I don't like that shit, bro. That's one thing about the public transport that pisses me off. Mm. Even imagine, ah, oh, another story. On the London Overground now, yeah? Um get on a train, train's not even packed in it. I'm sitting down minding my own business. I was reading a book at the time, innit? And then a lady gets onto the train. There's still other spaces available. But you know the way the, the, the London Overground train is? These, with these trains, are like the older ones, innit? And the seats are like three and then two. And I'm sitting on the two one. Mm. And obviously I'm like on the aisle side. The woman's come, see me. And I could, I could feel the, the eyes staring at me, innit? Yeah. But I'm not paying attention. I'm just, you know, reading my book. And she's like, can you move your bag, please? And I'm just thinking, Right, like bare attitude, innit? Mm. But I'm like, alright, whatever, innit? Put the bag on my lap, <laughs> and she goes and squeeze up herself <laughs> into the corner, innit? And I think to myself, why would you, why would you do that? Like, obviously, you can see I'm not a small guy, innit? Mm. But whatever, innit? But the woman's all doing this, like digging her arm into me, like, and I'm looking at her like, <laughs> is this really happening? Like, that's what I'm thinking. And then she, she done this, like, to say she wanna give me back that same energy. And I'm thinking, like, it's trying to offer me out or something. Like, what's going on here? But I'm ignoring it, innit? Like but it's nice, you know. I would have yeah, 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 no, yeah, yeah, yeah. no, but hold on. I would have looked at you. You deserve like, that now, no, man. No, no, yeah, but hold on, hold on. Hold on. Too long, long, you, know? you know what it is? 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 Yeah, like, okay. The woman was probably like about 50 or so, innit? Doesn't matter. I don't care. 50 English woman Rude, now. This has I don't no, care. But obviously, no I'm a big black guy, innit? I don't care. No, but here's the reason why I didn't want to do anything, innit? Because there's people sitting opposite me, yeah, and they're clocking what's going on. There's also a woman standing like above me as well. She's also clocking what's going on. And people are starting to pull out camera phones, innit? And I'm starting to feel myself get irate. But because I've seen the phones now, I'm telling them, I'm, I'm literally whispering to oh. myself, keep your cool, don't rise to it, do not move mad, innit? Because oh, you would have seen man on the camera, like, nah, you're right. No, I've got I, my I don't protect. No, no, mad. Yeah. no, but I would have been a first big black no, but, guy. <laughs> right. You don't need to know, but you don't need to be mad aggressive. I would have been like, if, if the cameras have come out and they can see no, you digging, man, I would have been like, are you all right? No, but hold on. You got she, itch so on your she, arm or something. So like, imagine, is there something there? Yeah, imagine I'm digging, man. I'm reading. Move, yeah, let me man. Let me, so she turns to me. She's Damn. like, "Car, can you move your arm, please?" I'm like, "What do you mean, move my arm? Like my arm's 
in a normal position, the same way the way your arm is. Was it got the two little? It's not even got the things there. Oh, okay. but then she's like, obviously the, the seats partitioned, didn't it? She's okay, like, oh, yeah, but yeah, you're yeah. on my side. And I said, well, I go with Jim. I can't help that I'm wired. And yeah, then people true. started laughing on the train, and she's like, oh, but I paid for my seat. And I'm like, but this is London Overground. And everyone was like, well, we paid for a ticket, and we can't get. You're not seat. That. You can't reserve your seats, isn't it? Cool, whatever. This woman still going and doing all of this and doing all of that, and I'm just like. Let me just not even Rab, react I would, to Rab, I don't care mad. about cameras. I would have turned around and said, stop digging me or move from me. No, I, <laughs> I, said, Rab, I, I said to her. I, I would have said, said move. I like, said who told her. you to sit your... That's like, what I said to the her. The first thing, when she said to move the bag, I would have, uh, and she uh, the attitude. I'm like, when you fix your attitude. Yeah. But, but you know it was, though. It's just, it's one of them ones where it's like, when I looked and I saw the type of woman that she was, I was like, oh, you know nah, what? Nah, fam, I don't she care. She said move the bag. I'd be like, when? I don't, hey, it's not gonna you're be now, nice, boy. but me, I don't, I, I don't care how old you, and you know what, them old white mm. English women are the oh. worst, <laughs> fam, like, let an <laughs> old English woman chat to man like that, fam. Right. I'm waiting, fam, because I know you're racist. Mm. No, I, obviously. I, I look at obviously. them like they're racist, fam. No, not all of them. It not probably them, was, it them. probably was that, because the thing is, I take it onto a little bit, I'm like, I said to her, at your big age, you're behaving like this, your children should be disgusting. I'm like, actually, then again, your children are probably like you if they're raised by you, innit? And after, obviously, people are laughing or whatnot. And she's all like, oh, you're yeah, acting. I can't hear you. I can't hear you. I'm like, see, look how immature you're acting. You come on the train, squeeze yourself up here. There's not even enough space for you. You're too big for this space. And look at the size of me. And there's still space on the train, but you want to force yourself I to squeeze here and do all like this that. to try and prove a point that you could match up to me just because I'm physically bigger than you or whatnot. But it's just... At the time, initially, when it first started off, I was getting irritated because I'm not a morning person. And you're coming to do all of that and I can feel myself. I'm I'm raging inside, innit? But it's just like, keep my cool. When I saw them cameras, I was like, I cannot go viral off of this. <laughs> if this happens, my that job's, bro. Do you get me? Nah, I can't. can't I can't. For that. No, no, no bro, we don't have to batter up. You just, you know what it you is? just you get what, me. Do you know what it is? You say that, yeah, but you can get fired for it because it's one of them ones where it's like, Depending on the organizations you work for, sometimes okay, yeah, they yeah. don't want to keep you around because they don't want to be associated with someone who comes across as aggressive to that sort of person. And you know, some people, it's like when certain things go viral, or whatnot, the narrative sometimes can get flipped. Yeah, Do you get yeah, what I'm trying yeah, to say? Yeah, Especially yeah. on who's posting the things out or who's putting whatever captions with whatever, the narrative can get flipped. So I just said, you know what? Let me just keep my composure because I can't come and get embarrassed like this. And man's got bills to pay, so I can't lose yeah, my job. Nah, I hear you that. get me? Nah, you just got to do it in a smart way. Just mm. say, why are you digging me? When the cameras come out, then I'm, I'm, what, are you all right? Are you digging me? Mm. Like you can't see the cameras can see you digging me. I'm not gonna lie, I'd be bare rude though. Yeah, I would be rude, I'd be bro. Bare rude still. You see me from the get go, from mm. when she said move your bag, I'd be like, I don't know who you're talking to. Yeah, exactly. Well, I don't, you know what? She you, said please, fam. but obviously there was a bit of like, a forced it assertiveness. Was no, no, it was yeah, a first. It was, it, was, it was a forced assertiveness because it was almost like she was trying to prove a point that she can demand a seat type of thing. Exactly, yeah. and that for that reason, there I would have been like, I don't know who you're talking to. When you fix the attitude, this bag will move, mm. and then I'll go back to do what I'm doing. Well, she picked up your bag and dash it. No, that's what? mad. I would have dashed her still. <laughs> Pick up what bag and dash, dash what? Fam. That's mad. That yeah, one there is mean? mad. You can't uh, be dashing. An old shit. woman, fam, bro. Yeah, you have to dash her still. No, nah, that's a bit mad. You can't but be dashing my bag. You can't. dash That's mad. That's Why not? Huh? Why not? Why would you be dashing so, my stuff? Because I could have, I would have moved it anyway. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Yeah. But it's one of them ones where yeah, it's you like- You may not have moved it quick enough for Nah, her. but the thing is, yeah, like I said, she was towering over me, innit, when I'm sitting down minding my own business, innit? If you want to sit down, just be like, oh, do you mind if I sit there? Calm. I would have moved it anyway. And more time, when the train starts to get busy, I tend to do that anyway, because someone's going to ask me to sit there. Do you get mm. me? But it's just, it's almost is like she it, wants to prove a point. Are you sure you wasn't sitting in the priority seats, fam? No, bro. <laughs> 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 no, I'm what you no, but it's true. It now, like, it's a good question, but she yes. weren't no priority for anything. Yeah, she she weren't, weren't no priority for anything. She, she was going to work. She's like elderly. She's elderly, bro. 50's not that elderly, bro. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, it's yeah, not yeah, elderly. It's not. She looked about 50. She could have been 35. You know, some of them don't age well. No, but some of them don't age well, innit? She don't pass for a freedom pass yet, still. Nah. She ain't that, she, I she feel like that this old. story's a bit shaky still. I feel like my mom was in the priority seat with his nah, bag. Nah, I wasn't, I wasn't. I think yeah. old woman wanted it from. No, nah, not even, bro. Well, she like, wanted the big guy. <laughs> she just wanted to prove a point, I guess. I don't know. Maybe she saw it's something nice. on TV where it looked like, you know, we're doing a bit too well. She thought, no, nah, I don't like this. We're taking over our country. You said too well, you know. <laughs> you know, funny, you know. All right, boy. But yeah, that was that. <laughs>